tonight, a shocking image, a dog tied to the back of a tow truck on Route 128. Tonight, we're hearing from the man who took that photo. Now, it is a photograph that definitely got the attention of state police, and WBZ's Lisa Greshi has the story. My blood pressure went through the roof. Michael Gary, an animal lover himself, is talking about the moment he was driving on 128 and looked over to see something he couldn't believe. And I see this, what looked like a stuffed animal. So... I got up a little closer and I really got a good look at it, and it was a dog. Frantic, he tried to get the driver's attention before calling police. The driver pulled off at Route 16. Gary lost him, but knew he had to get the word out. I posted it on Facebook for my buddies to just kind of like put it out there, you know, and it went unreal. It went ballistic. People on Facebook outraged. The company name could be seen on the side of the tow truck. We went to Ramsey's for answers. Those who work here at Ramsey say that driver is known to bring his dog into work sometimes and usually it's fine but with this tow the people needed a ride and that's how the dog ended up in the back. We watched as police left the owner of Ramsey's home this afternoon. He did not come to the door. Instead, the company's Facebook posted, We have just been made aware of the photo that is circulating on Facebook. We do not support the driver's actions, and he was terminated immediately. Now, the Animal Rescue League and state police are both investigating. We're trying to find out how many times that was done also, so we know of two. As the viral picture continues to circulate, Gary hopes it speaks for the animals who can't speak for themselves. Animals are part of your family. There was enough slack on that leash that that dog could have easily fall off the side and been caught up in the tire. Reporting in Waltham, Lisa Greshi, WBZ News.